white to the white. Radio station with more. You're listening to the radio station. You're listening to. No, no, no. You're listening to. This is Radio Biafra. 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 Yes, once again, I welcome you to this morning's special edition. Of course, I hope you have not forgotten. Our religious body here in IPOB have declared the next seven days as the days of worship. And honestly, we have gone through a lot as a people. And God has made it possible for all of us to be here today. Considering what we have gone through as a people, we actually do not have any reason why we cannot appreciate the Creator. This is Radio Biafra Israel for the avoidance of doubt. And we are streaming live through Radio Biafra London. Radio Biafra London is being anchored by the deputy leader of the indigenous people of Biafra. His name is Mazi Uchi Okafomefo. He is from Abatete. Abatete is in Anambra State. In Anambra State is Biafra land. Mazuchu Kafor Mefo is the man who have assured us. He has sworn an oath that he will not allow the heart of this project to see corruption, 
This is one promise that blows my mind each time I remember that. Each time I bring that to an account. I do not expect you to understand the mindset behind that. But one day you shall. He is standing in a deputizing capacity on behalf of our supreme leader. His name is Mazen Nande Okukano. He is the king of Afali Beku. He is the director of Radio Biafra and the director of Biafra Television. He is the leader of IPOB. He is the only man who stood up to speak for the collective interest of the Biafran people for almost 60 years. And Fari Beku is in Omwahia. Omwahia is in Abia State. And Abia State is Biafra land. And of course, by the grace of Chukuki Kabiyama, the one who lives in heaven and presides over the affair of man, the one who has set our feet upon this path that we must follow. I am George Onyibi. I come from Abo. Our boys in Delta State, and Delta State is Biafra land. And honestly, we cannot proceed until we acknowledge him. He who made the heavens and the earth. For we do not lift up our eyes to men, even though they are faithful and sincere. Their life is but a breath before the Almighty Creator. We lift up our eyes to he who made the heavens and the earth. And as always this morning, I will acknowledge him. I have made you too small in my eyes. Oh Lord, forgive us. We have believed in the lies that you are unable to help us. But now, O oh Lord, we see our wrong. Heal our heart and make our life strong. And in my eyes and in my heart, O oh Lord, be magnified. Be magnified, O oh Lord. You are highly exalted. For there is nothing you can do, O oh Lord. Our eyes are on you. Be magnified, O oh Lord, be magnified. Any na jage mau ni hina imaramai ihona nyage ni na ge ubio mage o juru anya nya dadio ingwe gembangu o di gunye di kage ibu wa fano mega ani ni ni na sina. Nende mao Isi, Isi, Isi. And of course, this morning, apology. I will not be able to replay our leaders' broadcast, but I will be going to our evangelist, evangelist Agnes Mukike, who will lead IPOB religious group ahead of this worship. And of course, don't worry, other broadcasters will come on after this time and they will surely replay that broadcast for you in case you missed it but that having been said i will be going to biafra land to bring in the religious people i'll be back in a minute radio station with more Listening to the radio station. You're listening to no, no, no. You're listening to this is Radio Piazza. Radio Piazza. Yes, of course, some persons have been wondering who sent these people. And now maybe you begin to have an idea who sent us here. And then maybe you begin to understand how, why we talk the way we talk. And now maybe you begin to understand what we represent. And now maybe you will understand how determined we are. 
because there is a power that shapes our way. And he is the God who has set our feet upon this path. And I humble myself this hour to bring in our mommy, Evangelist Agnes Mokike. She will be in the best position to tell you whatever you need to know about this moment of praise and worship. Are you there on the line, Mark? Can you hear me? Yes, I am here. Good morning, sir. My yes, good morning, ma. Go ahead. You are on to the word, please. I say good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night to some of you, depending on your time zone. This is a great day, the day that the Lord has met. Today is Thursday, the 21st of June, 2020. And we are gathering everywhere all over the world to appreciate, to give thanks to He who has held us all these years. And that is Chukwo Kikabiyama. For there is none like Him. From everlasting to everlasting, He remains our God. He is the Lord of Lords. He is the God of Gods. He is the King of Kings, the Immortal Redeemer, the Holy One of Israel, the Only Wise God, the Elohim, the El Shaddai, the Adonai, the King of Glory. He that stood seated between the cherubims and inhabited eternity. Onyedeka de Jehovah, there is none like you. Holy at you, Lord, all creation, call you God. Why? Yes, 
ancient of days. We worship you. We give you thanks because there is no God like you. You are the only God. You are the only true God. You are the only righteous God. The only holy God. You are the one that created everything, but you existed on your own. Or do you chigi na ya na amaka? Or do you mada ge na ya na amaka? Anya gare eke oke ne otitogi. No one will share your glory. For you alone are God. Beside you there is no other. This morning of Thursday, the 25th of June, 2020, Dear friends all over the face of the earth, led by our leader, Mazin Namdekanu, are giving you thanks. We are giving you praise for your kindness upon us, for your mercy upon us, for that which you have done, that which you are doing already, and that which you are yet to do. And that is the restoration of Biafra. By your mighty hand, you have delivered us from the hand of the wicked men and women and nations, even the contraction called Nigeria. You have delivered us. You have set us free from slavery and bondage. And we are giving you thanks, Lord, for sparing our lives. Hallelujah to you, great Jehovah. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Be thou exalted forever and ever and ever. He said, he said, he said. Thank you, dear friends, IPOB worldwide. As our presenter has already said, we are on seven days praise victory match. And the theme is, all the people of Biafra shall shout great shout of praises to Chukukukikabiyama. The walls of Nigeria shall fall down flat and we shall live. Just according to Joshua, chapter 6, from verse 1 to 5. And as of the apostles, chapter 16, 25 and 26, where God commanded the people of Israel to march round and shout, shout of praises. And the walls of Jericho collapsed. So as we sing and praise unto the Lord for these seven days, everything that is holding us, dear friends, from leaving Nigeria, we collapse completely and we shall leave. So get ready to leave Nigeria any moment. So this is the one, the beginning. And what we have in our flyers, our shadow, in our program, the Bible readings we are taking for today are Psalm 65, Psalm 66, Psalm 100, and Revelation chapter 7. I will just take a few verses from each and every one of the scriptures. You can read the whole as you think. praise God. And remember, wherever we see Israel, we put uh, Biafra. That is our usual way of reading. So I will read Psalm 65 from verse 1. To seven. 
Psalm 65, and it says, Praise waited for thee, O God in Zion, and unto thee shall the vow be performed. O thou that hearest prayer, unto thee shall all flesh come. And from here we have this song in Igbo language saying, Diko tuto ne de redu chukwa bia mani me bia fra Diko tuto ni ne ne de redu chukwa bia mani me bia fra Obu kwa gikai na ko la chukwa kwere So if you don't know, this is where that song came from. Psalm 65, verses 1 and 2. And it says, Iniquities against us, as for our transgressions, God has pushed them away. You are wondering why we are thanking God? He has pushed away our iniquities as a nation, Biafra. Blessed is that man, Mazinam de Kanu, whom God chose and caused to approach unto him, that he may dwell in the cause of the Lord. Their friends shall be satisfied with the goodness of the house of God, even the holy temple. Verse 5. By terrible things, the righteousness without answer us, O God of our salvation, who are the confidence of all their friends and of them both of Kosa region and upland, which by your strength, Chukwakika Abiyama, set it fast, the mountains being guarded by your power. You still let the noise of the seas, even that of the contraction called Nigeria, the noise of their ways, the Boko Harams, the Flani Hesmen, the Mehti Allah, even the Kabbals, and the tumult of the people, all their allied nations, you still their noise. They also that dwell in the utmost past are afraid at thy tokens. Thou makest the outgoings of the morning and the evening to rejoice. So that is why we are thanking you, Chukwu Kikabiyama. I am reading from King James Russian. I go to Psalm 66. Make a joyful noise unto God of your friends. Sing for the honor of his name. Make his praise glorious. Say unto God, how terrible art thou in thy works. Through the greatness of thy power, you have destroyed our enemies and made them to submit unto thee. All Biafra shall worship thee and shall sing unto thee. We shall sing to thy name. And we shall say, come and see the works of God. He is terrible in his doing toward the children of Biafra. He turned the sea into the dry land, and we went through the flood of food. There did we rejoice in him. His eyes behold the nations. 
Let not the rebellious exalt them themselves. Oh, bless our God to work together, all dear friends, and make the voice of his praise to be heard. Verse 9. Which holdeth our soul in life, and suffereth not our feet to be moved. For thou, O God, hast proved us. Thou hast tried us as silver is tried. Psalm 100. It says, Make a joyful noise unto the Lord, all dear friends. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with singing. Know ye that the Lord, he is our God, Chukwakikabiyama. It is he that had made us, and not we ourselves. We have his people and the sheep of his pasture. We shall enter into his gates with thanksgiving, and into his cause with praise. And that is how we got the song we sing. We shall enter his gates with thanksgiving in our hearts. We shall enter his cause singing praise. We shall say this is the day that you got your mouth has made your fault. We will rejoice for he has set us free. He has made us glad. He has made us glad. We are so glad. We will rejoice for he has made us glad. I rest of your prayer, yes. We has made us glad. We are so glad. Oh yes, we rejoice for he has made us glad. For the Lord is good. And his mercy is everlasting, and his truth endureth to all generations. And we get to the final place, and that is Revelation chapter 7. I begin to read from verse 2. And I saw another angel ascending from the east. Did you hear that? The angel is ascending from Biafra land. Having the seal of the living God. And he cried with a loud voice to the four angels. To whom it was given to hot Nigeria and all their allied nations. Saying, hot not them neither their sea nor trees till we have sealed the servants of our god in their foreheads verse 4 and i heard the number of them which we are sealed and there we are sealed and hundred and forty and four thousand of all the tribes of biafra and of the tribe of the province of Abia, they were sealed. Of the province of Aquaibo, they were sealed. Of the province of Anambra, they were sealed. Of the province of Bayasa, they were sealed. Of the province of Cross River, they were sealed. Of the province of Delta, they were sealed. Of the province of Eboi, they were sealed. Of the province of Enugu, they were sealed. Of the province of Imu, they were sealed. Of the province of Rivers, they were sealed. Of the province of Ibaike in Edo, they were sealed. 
of the province of Idoma in Benue, they were sealed. Of the province of Lingala in Kogi, they were sealed. Of all the different clans of Ijo, of Ishekiri, of Ibo, of Urobo, of Isobo, and so on and so forth, they were all sealed. And I get to verse 11. And all the angels stood round about the throne and about the elders and the four beings and fell before the throne on their faces and worshiped God, saying, Amen, Amen. Blessings and glory. Wisdom, thanks given, and honor, power and might, be unto our God, forever and ever, amen. Amen, amen, blessings and glory, wisdom that's given, and honor, power and might, be unto our God. POB members worldwide, we are singing unto the Lord. For we have a reason to praise this great Chukwo Gigabiyama, our God, our Father, who has delivered us. Are you thinking of why you are going to join in the praise and worship and thanksgiving song? For your life today, <laughs> for the deliverance by the mighty power of Chukwokika Abiyama. The nations encircled us, the enemies encircled us, but the Lord destroyed them, the Lord hindered them from invading our land, the Lord hindered them from wiping us out. He has delivered us from the hand of the wicked Nigeria. So we are singing and praising the Lord. That is why you will join. We are just starting today. We have seven days to go. He said we shall not ask him anything. We shall not pray for anything. That we shall just sing and praise him. And we shall see his mighty hand. Are you ready to join? Sing along with me. What is it, Amona? Oh, Ribie, What is it, Amona? Oh, Ribie, Boma, 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 Boma. Boma, Boma, see a pirie, what you get it, Amuna, Oribie, 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 Taiburo, Tutu, Bulgara, Tuku, Abiyama, Ome, Orani, Mao, Kai buru tutu bugara tu kuo ai bugara ya o me ora ni ma to ya 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 ni na bi mai kai 
Buru tutu bugara chukuo bugara ya ome urani do 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 jana diari wado do jana do 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 jana diari wado do jana do jana diari wado do jana do jana diari wado do jana do we have lovely songs of praises unto our God Chuku Kikabiyama. And we shall sing the praising for he has given us life. For he is the one that created us. No other one. No other God. He has set us free. He has delivered us. He has saved us from bondage and slavery and given us eternal freedom. Bring him thanks. Chukwoki Kabiyama, we give you thanks. We give you praise. We appreciate you. Give on the rie, no rie, no rie, ni. Agu batoya, mbada waroso. Oke mwaka na tugi. Unyindi mozi na madu nekele. Kaji hova bo. Unyindi mozi na madu nekele. Kachu kwa bia mabo. Unyindi mozi na madu. Na kwisi ala nyeo. Unyumu bia frani nekele. Iye, 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 iye. Chukwe biye biye 
Father, we are giving you thanks and praise. We worship you, the Most High God. You are the King of Kings. You are Jehovah of Omo Biafra. We are grateful unto you. We are grateful. You have done so much for us. We cannot tell it all. For you are worthy of our praise. 
you that has done so much for us you have done great things for us and we have no option than to give you thanks to dance unto you to praise you to magnify your name to exalt your holy name in the land of Biafra and all over the face of the earth Biafra are giving you thanks we are grateful unto you Appreciate you. We thank you for our leader Mazinam de Kano. Thank you for your protection upon his life. Thank you for our deputy leader Mazu Chemefo. Thank you for your protection and wisdom and understanding that you are giving unto them to pilot the affairs. Our leader ni kukuye non gimu abu chuku abyama na eme ya nobuye nyawa. He has not shared in your glory. He has returned all glory to you. Thank you for our African rep, Mazi Onibe, who every morning, every evening, he is on radio. Onye maka o esi wele ewete ihaneri na nege ne provide. Ngare ni ne ona gare na nege ne eche kwa baha. Kede ife me na ya meke nege. Ansi ge dalo. Mma ma de rege. Dalo makandi IPO binine. No wanine. You are increasing the number by yourself. Every day, every day people are joining. You are the one that are settling our bills. Father, we are grateful. In the IPO being by from our leader, Mazin Namdekano, to the least man in the unit, to the person that 
just joined you last night. Father, we are saying all glory, all honor, all power, all dominion, all excellency be ascribed unto your holy name forever and ever. He said, He said, He said, Thank you, my Zoni Ben, for giving me the opportunity. Thank you. The Lord bless you and the Lord continue to strengthen you. Thank you as you have granted me the opportunity to open up the praise and worship session for dear friends for seven days. The name of the Lord will be highly exalted continually. He said, he said, he said, thank you very much, thank you. ma. Thank you very and much. And remain blessed. Thank you very much. May the Lord continue to guard and to be with you. That in the end, every labor and sacrifice of life all of you have made will surely be rewarded. Thank you very much, ma. We must continue. Yes, of course, this is where we will be rounding up on this very segment. Be a France across the globe as you go about your daily business. Make sure that you do the needful. Nigeria must be dismembered because it is simply the evil enclave. Our duty is to make sure that every slave in Nigeria is set free. It is ridiculous to understand how we came about that name when our leader was preaching yesterday here on Radio Biafra. He said something and I could see clearer. He talked about how we got that name. And when we say certain things, people do not understand. They choose to look at the light. Instead, they embrace the darkness. Now we know better. One prostitute following one hooligan from India. Frederick Lugard was a hooligan, a bastard. Born on that bridge somewhere in India. As an act of terrorism, meted out on him. He became instrument of destruction. To undermine the sovereignty of Africa as guided by the British government. He came here with a prostitute. That is why they didn't have children. Their children would have suffered more than hell themselves. And the prostitute, out of drunkenness, gave us Niger area. It looks to me they were mocking us. It looks to me they were using us to make caricature that night. And then men and women who choose to hide the truth in order to continue allowing that resources from our land to feed them will keep quiet. Just imagine what they were doing that day, fornicating and calling us hopeless name. And you are still very happy. Hey, we the Nigeria, you are an idiot. And now you understand why reverence like us choose not to have respect for you. If you are the light, come out, we know you as the light. Do not be darkness because you will not hide any hiding place. If you are darkness, then be proud of who you are. We give it to you after all. God did not kill Satan. But the truth is that the Biafra we seek for, the Biafra we long for, God will be a very clean one, a very righteous one. It is not in any distant land. It is in our hearts. Let our action this day define who we truly are and what we preach. I sign off from here. I remain George Onyibe. And do have a wonderful day ahead of you. Ndei wonu. Ndei wonu. Bible clearly shows where the true Israelites are and where the Messiah is going to gather his people. Judah, he's going to gather from the four corners of the earth. But the other tribes, he will gather from beyond the rivers of Cush in Africa. Kindle in the night that came and blew us away. And like a thief in the night that came and stole it away. We've been in the bondage for so long. We need a light. All the dear friends should stand up, rise up for your freedom. Raise the freedom song.
fighting to the end of time. We can't we we won't. Hey, Babylon, them walk us off in the way they brutality, them can never see. They rise in our face. Okay. 